no. I do. You try. Grab his arm. Hold him down. Oh. Penage Wilfred. I want to go to college. I can't get caught with shit like this. Come on, kid. Do it. as his company start paying out phony claims to fake clinics we set up or he pays hash to 250 grandiosa which we know he cannot do so uh when do you need this body right away i think i can get a party like that together Today, right now, in the mall. Confusion. Instability. You got DVD players in back? Don't hurt me, man. There's nothing beats popping up some other Redenbachers and listening to Men in Black, you know? You want something that much on? As the Talmud says, I don't give a shit what he says. Now we got you your get. You get us our twenty-five percent. Got it? How you doing? <laughs> Honey, hold on. What are you doing? You leaving us? They made me an offer I couldn't refuse. Yeah, well, you haven't heard ours yet. Brand new, surround sound, HD TV compatible. Put it down. No, I mean it. Pick it up. I don't think you quite understand. Oh, I understand, all right, only too well. If you did, you'd do what they want. Who is it? Evening, ma'am. He has our dog. Open the door. Mm. Any hinky shit, you'll be mm. refrying beans mm. with Pablo Escobar again. Fresh champagne, gentlemen. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh. I want to see the report. I can't get my hand. I want to see the fucking 302. All right. All right. Let's see what I can do. It's Wayne Hawaii. You got my okay. Make sure you send a message to everybody else. Chucky Signore. You know, Mikey's now too high up. So Chucky's gotta disappear without setting off any alarms. Right up the point here. <laughs> please, please. I can feel it itching me already. Happy life, which is more than I can say for you. All right, that's enough. Yeah. Keep it moving. Keep. There you go, kid. There you go. You big motherfucker. It's done. 
spend more time down at the brokerage. You're the fucking SEC compliance officer, for Christ's sake. If we cold call enough senior citizens, pump and dump. Yeah, yeah, listen. Well, Bistix is at 80. Why don't we dump in the stock? You'll know that when you need to know that. You tell my uncle that he gets to keep 5%. 5% of his shy, his sports betting. Same with the coke. He's been going around telling Soprano business to anybody who'll listen. He's the one that's been saying that shit about you trying to whack your mother. It Maybe send some guys down and, you know, make it uncomfortable for these people. Like you did with your unions before. It's gonna cost you. <laughs> Not familiar with the instrument panel. Get up out the car! Take the car! Take the car! What's this? Far. Oh my church, charge on car. In Eastern Europe, you can sell this car for 110, 120 thousand. My price to you, 90 grand. Well, you want to get involved in people's problems? Here. Yeah, it's the now you're fucking involved, okay? There's a buzzer under the desk, an office in the back. I do capito. Yeah. Damn, son of a bitch! Oh. I wouldn't do anything to insult you. Our kids go to the same school together. <laughs> I'm sorry. My luck's gonna change. Tomorrow, man. I want something tomorrow. You understand me? Just so you know, Chris spoke to us about it. He wanted we should give you a taste from the safe. Just take it easy, will you? We just want to talk to you. God, Bobby! Bobby, please, Tony, please! Hey, pal, with the rum lotion. Put three cases of that in my car. Got it. He says take uh, three gross of the blue coolers. He'll give us a price in the red. Well, fuck that. He's never getting paid anyway. Davey, how we doing with that books of airline tickets? Want to raise a red flag with the travel agency? When's one of these vendors gonna realize I'm never gonna pay him and call the cops? That a safe? Yeah, why? A little over 400K in there. I want you to hold it for me. Hello? Yeah, T, it's me. Hey. Listen, that container came in from the other side. I genuinely don't think there's anything to gain by keeping him around. Get it done. Take a shower. Give me the clothes and the shoes you got on. Get him out of here. Get rid of him. Bring his car to the salvage crusher. Telecommunications once again fails to disappoint. What's this thing? Telephone calling cards. You sell thousands of these cards to the greedy pricks. Cards at a cut rate. But you bought the bulk time on credit, remember? The carry gets stiffed. He cuts off the service to the cardholders, but you already sold all your cards. Is that okay, Tony? Did I sit? <laughs> Recycling manager over there, Joe Zachary. He knows who's in line for that contract. The next minute, he's threatening to go to the EPA, bust us all. He said that? I fix it. Joe Zachary? Yeah. Well, I'm just saying, because 
This isn't the first time. You do whatever you gotta do. It has to be the old man, huh? There's no other way? There's a million other ways. But this one will work. <laughs> Any more smart me, Rob? No, Mr. Buckle up, please, please, no more! Hey. So what's your story with this fucking speeding ticket, Assemblyman? What? I'm on it, I told you. Hey, good news about the Riverfront Esplanade thing. We still on for Thursday? Restaurants, stores, slips for luxury yachts. Oh. Get a sheet, Chrissy. Cover that up. Keep that back door locked and get her the fuck out of here. They were selling them. What? What did you say? Oh. Oh. Quarter million there, my own personal funds. I'll send it to Moscow with the Airbnb thing pads. But this time, I want to use Brom Street Bank. Anyway, then I'll send it to the Isle of Man, to your bank, numbered account. Go ahead. <laughs> Police were called to the scene of what appeared to be a Christmas prank gone awry. Delivery driver Igor Parnaski was found trapped under Santa's sleigh and severely beaten. Come on, it's all right. I just want to talk to you. I just told you Nice. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Standard operating procedure. Here's some standard operating procedure. Stay the fuck away from Tony Soprano. Shut the fuck up. You call or go anywhere near him or his family, and they'll be scraping your nipples off these fine leather seats. Hey, throw it all away. Oh, Wait, no, I'll fucking John D. Rockefeller. Wait, no. Oh. See over there. Guy in there killed your father. Hey. Good luck. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What are you gonna do? Come on, give me the nod. On Johnny? You want my advice? You'll call Lou DiMaggio. What, those sick old fucks in Rhode Island? They may be old, my little nephew, but those dogs can still hunt. What you have in mind, then? Not too fancy, as long as he disappears. It's your money. Uh, 20 grand, we said. Half up front. I read about this, uh, Fugazi mortgage loans or something, right? Actually, ever hear of HUD? Housing development, yeah. You get a front man to buy houses in some crummy neighborhood. I'm talking about some real shit boxes. Maybe they're worth, like, hundred grand a piece. Thing is, though, unforeseen construction delays and repeated vandalism forced the project into dissolution. We all walk away from the houses. Your cut will be in the 10% of the profit range. What do you want me to do? Exert some influence, make some calls. Get the donut squad to go down there and rouse the shit bags. <laughs> This is crazy. Oh, Tony! Tony! This is Xanadu compared to that courtroom. I'm milking this thing for all it's worth. Maybe you're not milking it enough. Yellow. Oh, what the fuck are you doing? Just on our way to St. Stephen's Green, grab some dinner. Why? What's going on? What's going on? Back here in the States, I think we got a mistrial. They call this woman. She runs an elder care agency. She's got an RN that'll play ball. All you gotta do is act two bots. Even don't talk with you. Yeah. 
Well, you're acting like uh, some kind of ski junkie. Oh. <clears throat> Can you help buy this thing? Take these out back later and burn them. Tony bought three more houses than the appraisals, Victor. I can't. I told you, please. Johnny and Carmine's guys, they hurt me. You said little poorly to trash Carmine's restaurant? We're gonna take out Carmine Lopatazzi. It should look like a car jack. You get the down payment? Tony said you should unlock the closet and give me the scoopette, he called it. No, for God's sake. They will probably go through their entire lives not knowing that their father's sperm was smuggled out of jail to get Nancy pregnant. It was the least I could do. Let me the fuck out! I'll kill all of you! Fucking cocksucker, where's my fucking money? I'll get it, I'll get it. My neck, Tony. Bureau of Alcohol and Tobacco. Some fucking bodega newick's been selling cigarettes without the tax stamps on it. Stupid spicks. They were supposed to stamp them themselves. Anyway, I'm, I'm on my way up there now, and uh, I'm gonna send Syl by to pick you up then, okay? Jesus Christ. You need to go up to the farm and pick up your cousin. She'll be buried. Um. Hey, I'll take care of it. I won't forget it completely insulate ourselves. They do rusty, they're back on a plane over the Atlantic two hours later. Some friends coming over from Naples, paying a visit to a guy from New York. You should provide him a couple of dumb gats, guidance on where to find them. Eastern Parkway. Eastern Parkway, not the Belt Parkway. Who the fuck are you guys? That's who I am, you damn fucking Diverted a truck, a semi-trailer full of central multivitamins. Could be distributed in uh, Long Island. It's my end. 50-50. If we don't, Atlantic City, forget it. Why the change up? I can't keep fighting Phil on this. Our businesses are all entwined. You gotta pick your battles. You want your no-show jobs, Vito's gotta go. He's just wondering if he thought about my offer. Yeah, I thought. But I need to know who these Atlantic City contacts are. Meet me in the mall, 11 o'clock. Don't be late. Carlo. Still hit him first. Let me just. Yeah. It's 
done. Listen. Well, at this moment, we could also sell to you Fasamax, medication for uh, you know, osteo osteoporosis. You know, for the woman, their bones. What a counterfeit? No, no, no. They're true. They're from uh, Assurance Maladie, but uh, expiré, like uh, old. Change the date. Nobody knows. You knock your price down to uh, 35 grand, day, and we'll see what we can do about making your sister's custody problem go away. You'll take care of this, right? Sure. I got a trailer full of power tools coming in later on this month. I can get for you 50 cents on the dollar. 60 grand. Sit down. Easy. Easy. We gotta hit first. And this all dovetails with other information I got that this cocksucker already has a target on my back. It's a big move. Shut the rubbish. Eight hundred rounds per. Phil, I don't know. It's changed. You got my word. We'll back off. My price is you help us get a location on Phil. I can't go there. Well, you do what you gotta do. I should get a sixty-day supply of the planet. <laughs> What is that? Wow. Is this it? Oh, thank God. Will you tell them he's got a medical condition? This is his family doctor right here. Ask him. Ah! 